Hello everyone, Astra and Talon here. Welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Silent Hill Blind. Uh, we're picking up today in the infirmary in the hospital and I've got to try and kind of remember where we need to go for this. It's been a while. It's been a few days since I was last able to pick up the game. So we're going to have a look around on the rooms down here, uh, see what we can find and go from there. In the last episode I remember us facing off against quite a few of those odd doctors and nurses. Um, they take a lot of bullets to put them down, so you kind of want to not really fight them too much if I can avoid it. I'm going to have to try and remember what we need to do, where we need to go. Not that way, apparently. Um, so we can't get through to the examination room. I feel like I've done the is down here, so do you think it's worth going down further, down to the basement, Just through this way? Kind of remember, having to remember first of all what I needed to do. Yeah, I've been here already. So let's see if I can get down to the basement this way. Hopefully that will provide us with our next destination or our next clue, uh, next item, I don't know what. Yep, cutscene, so this is definitely where we need to go. Oh no. Again, the amount of time it took to load, I thought that was going to be a cutscene. But we haven't actually been through any of the doors down here, so this is going to be where we need to go. Oh shit. Oh, these guys haven't gotten me up to this point. The fact that there's two of them. Let me turn around, come on. Ah, oh, fuck's sake, I'm stuck in a corner. Let's try changing up for the shotgun instead. On the plus side, they don't actually seem to be doing me much damage. Nope, spoke too soon. In dire bastards. That was problematic. I could have done with uh, not facing off against both of those at the same time. Especially so that I now only have eight shells left. And 30 bullets. Not good. Not good at all. So we do better than that. Uh, let's have a look at the generator room first, which is this one here. That at least seems to be a little quieter. Generator is on. Yes, I know. I turned it on back in the, I guess, the real world? I don't know if it's the real world or just another world. That one's locked. Getting in there, then. Aha! Basement storage key. I can see something over there. I think that's shotgun shells. Anything else? Better leave the drug. Yeah, because nothing could make this place worse at all. Shotgun shells. Hell yeah! Need more of those after uh, our last few encounters. And a first aid kit. No, sorry, that's not a first aid kit, that's handgun bullets. Yes, brilliant, I'll take that. Question is, is there anything else we need in here? Storeroom's quite big, I'd be surprised if there wasn't at least one more thing of use. To kind of get used to the controls again. It's been about a week since I was able to pick this up last. So I'm sort of feeling my way around. What about the cupboard over there? Nothing inside. Okay, so looks like it was just the bullets and the shotgun shells. I thought there'd be a bit more than that, but never mind. I think this is the only other room we can get into. 
It's the morgue. Of course it's the morgue. Where else would it be? Ah, these things again. Both of them. Go of me! Oh. I can deal with these things when there's just one of them, but when there's two of them and they kind of ambush you, that's not great at all. Where's my health drink? Wrong button. There we go, that'll do me. Is that another health drink? No. Check the health drink out. There, that's right. So. Huh. There's nothing else in here at all. Aside from the isopropyl alcohol, which we knew about. Let's have a quick look. Let's see if there's anywhere we've missed, not been able to get into, etc. Maybe the entrance by the lift there. We can get through there. It's the third floor. Okay, we'll try getting upstairs then. I feel like I should take this lift. It doesn't feel like a good lift to be using in the current state of things. Loading screen? Yes, okay. Try the entrance door. No. Okay, then I'm stuck. Isopropyl alcohol, but that's about it. There's got to be a reason to use that uh, alcohol. I don't know what it is, though. through here already. Nothing through. Let me try and go back upstairs, see if I can find anything up there. Honestly, don't know where I need to go here. Do do do. Wonder if it's worth me. You know what? I wonder. If I'm gonna have a quick look again at the basement. Why did I get the key when all that was down there was what ammunition, ammunition and a health drink? It just doesn't feel right. Yeah, this way. And it's the last room on the right hand side. I feel like I'm missing something down here. Check the place over again. Locks jammed, so we can't get in there. Oh, well, there's something. How the hell did I miss that? 
What's a hammer? What's the hammer used for, I wonder? Um doo -doo -doo. Oh, okay, it's must be a weapon. Let's try it. Looks like he's going golfing. Okay. That could be useful. That could definitely be useful. So, without anything else, I've picked something out down here that I missed the first time around. I feel like there's something here maybe I'm missing? I don't know. Empty bottles... I'm trying to ignore that music. It's, yeah, it's creepy. And it's not really helping. Doesn't look like there's anything else in here. Skip marks from the cabinet being moved. Ah, ha, ha. Can I use it from this side? Yes, yes, I want to push the cabinet. Yes, I do. Slender door. Does it lead me to? Does it lead me through to. I thought the storeroom was a little bit too big. Huh. Looks like a hallway under the grate. Can't move it since the bones and vines have grown around it. Um, I wonder if we can use the alcohol and the lighter? I think isopropyl's uh, flammable. It's pretty strong. Um, pretty strong percentage of alcohol. Yeah, that'll do it. Boom. We have our heading. Or at least something, uh, something new. I have the map for this place. Of course, I don't. Okay, that works really well against these things. I don't know if that one's actually dead. Nearly, which means I wonder if the other one here is dead. Well, it's going to save me some handgun bullets, or some shotgun shells at the very least. Stay down. Ah, of course it is. Yeah, that would be too easy, surely. Ah! Hey, dude, he's right there. Swing for him. Okay, that's got him down. At least there aren't more than two. Close range, that would have been really difficult to deal with. With a weapon. This looks empty. Yep, okay. Let's go and have a look through the other rooms down here. This weird ass sub basement place. I've got to say, I'm quite liking the hammer. It's a uh, ooh, videotape. Sure, remember there being a VCR somewhere up on one of the upper levels. I'll have to go and check that out. Yeah, the hammer's great at dealing with these nurses. Saving saving me a lot of ammunition, a lot of ammunition. 
which is good because it blew through a lot of it. The first part of the hospital. What's this? Looks like someone's been here. Alyssa. Alyssa? Alyssa. And a key. Examination room key. Okay. So we know roughly where we're going to be going next. There's another room to check out down here first. Oh, uh, or not. Back upstairs then. Gonna keep the hammer equipped for now. Maybe build up a bit more stock of ammunition. Uh, other way around. This will get us back upstairs. Which means I can check the map. Which means examination room key is on the first floor. I want to check the VCR out as well, which is up on the. Th Third? Third floor. Okay. That's where I'm going first. Up to the third. Um, use the lift. Can I use the lift? Yes, I can actually use the lift. Good. Be a little bit faster than uh, taking the stairs all the way up. Another loading screen. I thought it was going to be another cutscene for a second. So it's this way, and then all the way to the end, effectively back on ourselves. And this place is falling apart. It's not in a great state, is it? Now, which of the rooms was it? Second one along 302. This one here. And there's our... Ha, ah, there's our save pad. And our VCR. May as well save while we're here as well. creepy um, and I'm not entirely sure why there's something about static and incomplete logs which I suppose it's why they play well in stuff like System Shock it's kind of creepy right I've saved I'm gonna head downstairs to the first floor then which, if memory serves, I'm going to need to take the stairs for this because the lift is inaccessible on floor one. And the stairs should be right around here somewhere, I think. Right behind me. Oh no. No, I can use the lift. I may as well then. It's kind of much of a muchness, I suppose. may notice I'm still having the odd problem adjusting to the controls. I still struggle with the tank side of things. Just one of those things that I'll have to put up with, I think, for the for, for the rest of the game. Okay, straight to the end of the hall. And 
then in here. And then this one. Yes! Progress! And another cutscene. Ooh! If that was a demon nurse, he'd be dead now. Just FYI. Finally, someone else who's okay. Okay, such a strong term. Who are you? My name's Lisa Garland. What's yours? Harry Mason. Harry, tell me what's happening here. Where is everybody? Fuck news. I must have gotten knocked out. When I came to, everyone was gone. It's awful. So you don't know anything either. Great. Nobody seems to know I anything just don't at all. Get it. It's like this is all some kind of bad dream. Yeah, a living nightmare. Let me ask you, have you seen a little girl around here? Short, black hair, seven years old. A seven-year-old girl. What, she's your daughter? Yes. A seven-year-old girl. I can't so she was eight. I, I was unconscious all this time. I'm sorry. <sighs> That's all right. Do you know anything about all that weird stuff in the basement? Why? Is there something down there? You don't know? Don't you work here? We're under strict orders never to enter the basement storeroom. So I really don't know. What did you say was down there? Nobody's allowed down there, huh? You no, know, it's... Mm. Damn! My head! What's wrong? Harry? Harry, let me help you. Harry? Was I dreaming? You were too late. It's you. Yes, Dahlia Gillespie. Didn't ask for your name, but okay. Tell me everything you know. What's going on? Darkness. The town is being devoured by darkness. Strength must overcome petty desire, childish sleep talk. I knew this day would come. What are you talking about? I don't understand a word of this. Believe the evidence of your eyes. The other church in this town, that is your destination. This is beyond my abilities. Only you can stop it now. I mean, it seems he's less ab Have you not able than the she is, so... On the all over town? So that's what I saw in the schoolyard. What does it mean? It is the mark of Samael. Don't let it be completed. Hey, wait! Well... That's weird. Okay, so we I guess we're back in the real world, which means I'm going to head out to the save point and then this episode is going to be done. Um, next episode we're going to head towards the church again, or the next church, which is, can't check in here because reasons. I don't really know what to make of all this, but we're going to find out in the next episode. So for now, take care of yourselves, and I'll see you for the next one. Bye!